directing this for like an eight hour or so, I'm... Well, I just want to get this Freeman today. I, I think this account has Strawberry as the main? This is... Okay, yeah, this is my strawberry kit. No, I want to be in pro. Oh, I go. What a situation, huh? What the fuck is happening? Oh my god.
Oh, I forgot my name is Long Cup on here. Monkey D freaky. Uh, you, you came and <laughs> changed my name. Welcome in. <laughs> I'm streaming early because uh, I can't stream tonight. So here we are. One PM my time. Hey, monkey, do you freak? What if we suck toes? The, the monkey, the freaky image is probably one of my favorite images of all time. I threw it up on screen at some point. Yeah! <laughs> the European times, am I right? There's a party happening tonight, and we have friends over, and I'm like, shit, I, I can't stream early. I, I can't stream late like I normally want to, so, uh, here I am early. I'm gonna try to be, like, early tomorrow, but, like... Also late. Fucking blasters. God fucking damn. Yeah, look at you at work. Go back to work. Go continue pooping or something. Drink some pop there, bud. Yeah, uh... Taking care of, like, children is exhausting. Oh, that's spider phone. It's also like, I mean, everything I do, I'm exhausted all the time, so... I've, I've taken care of my niece and nephew a couple of times, but not, not too many to be I, I don't like leaving my room very often. Shit. It, it, it's, it's crazy. <laughs> It's also like, I, I don't like hearing the wiggles, like, at all, anymore. They, they play that way too often, and I'm like, oh, oh. Also, also Coco Melon. Coco Melon's a main staple, and I'm like, uh, I don't, I don't want to hear Coco Melon! Very often.
And nothing can stop Monkey D Freaky. Keep going. Uh, I, I'm sorry for setting those images to our group chat, uh, but I need to grab it. Oh, oh. oh wait, no, wait, wait, wait. Uh, I'll show Monkey D freaky image after this uh after this match. I forgot, I posted it up on threads. You got you guys know threads, that, that newest hip social media kids are now on. Or, or something like that. Fucking duelies, ah fuck bad. Yeah, ass bone there, eh? That's fucking definitely home. Dave, come on, fucking move it. Jesus. The fuck you mean this way, there, bud? Nuh ah. The fuck you doing? Why is he over fucking Slim Jim? God fucking damn. The fuck why are you throwing? Jesus fucking Christ. I have some Pepsi now. Fuck bud. Fucking rancid. Homie's fucking throwing the match at the end when we need it the most. Uh, does this have, like, a normal overlay? Pokemon 1, I, I never used, like, as I did the first episode. Uh, that's my original. Uh, big view? Uh, whoops. Oh. Fuck that, I'm gonna skip there. Oh, nope. Wrong one? There we go. A monkey D freaky. What if monkey did you lose me? Monkey D freaky ate ass and sucked toes. 
<laughs> that fucking image gets me every time. So stupid. Oh, whoops, I have to go turn off my uh, alarm. What's supposed to do? Uh, Fucking right. Fuck, did we do it? Fuck, it is freaky.
Ay, querido. Nah, we still got it. What be in the traps today?
It's, it's all fine. Uh, have fun with the, the sand on the hills. Uh, two was with, uh... What was his name? I think James was his name. I, I, uh, I've never played a Silent Hill game. I, I know, like, the one meme from the, uh, the Bloober House remake trailer where he goes, My heart. I loved her. Wait. That's all I know Silent Hill 2. I've been close to ordering a Japanese copy of it at some point. Same with the uh, Silent Hill games on uh, that system. I, I know English prices are really, really fucked for those games. I, I think I have the Wii one on my uh, collection list. I need to work on some more. I think. I, I have to go check that later. I was like, all I know is that James Nitro really likes them. Yeah, Shadow Memories. I just figured if it has a proper black case on Wii. I do it. I think at some point I'll play a uh, Silent Hill game on stream, probably for maybe next Halloween. Did you know? That next Halloween, uh, besides like this one, this year, this Halloween is gonna be uh, Psychonauts. The next year is gonna be Psychonauts 2. I have never really played those. I think whenever Silent Hill uh, F comes out, I'll probably pick that up and stream it. Oh, oh that is so expensive. Silent Hill 1 is like 200 bucks used. Jesus. Totally understandable. Have fun at work there, bud. Uh, what is the latest Silent Hill game? Ascension, right. I've been doing well. I hope you've been doing well. Uh, oh. <laughs> I, I think maybe for a fun stream at some point, I'll, I'll pick up the Silent Hill HD collection and like play that. I, I think it'd be funny, the, the little shitty versions. Yeah, it's like, telling how F seems neat because it, it, it's a lot more Japanese inspired. On top of it, like, being um, set way back instead of kind of current. If I can get my hands on it, uh, at some point this year, I will probably stream it, uh... 
I, I do wonder if we can... If it's backwards, uh, Xbox One... Uh, the Xbox One backwards compatibility thing also. I mean, play it that way if so. Ah, shit, we're gonna push these fucks. It's also, like, I haven't even really played much horror franchises. I've played Resident Evil 7, I really like that one. Uh, I played a bit of 2, is, uh, I have that on my PlayStation 1, uh, I bought a Japanese copy of that. And like, 8 seems cool? As far as like, kind of everything. I do want to play Resident Evil 4 at some point, uh, for the channel. Or maybe do a video on it, I'm not fully sure what I want to do yet.
Thunder, I'm back. It's like, I, I never really... I've gotten into the Survival 4 stuff. Holy... Uh, I'm so much of a baby, I, I don't like horror games very much. <laughs> So, so I haven't really played them. It's also like a lot of them interest me fully. It just really depends on the uh, what it's all about, really. Like, well, Silent Hill and Real and Evil doesn't really fully interest me at, at that. Yeah, I guess it also like, kind of depends on the type of horror, too. So it's like, like, with survival horror, you know you can always kind of, like, uh, have something to protect you within those games. I'll play something like the Final Fantasy Freddy is yeah, you're you're kinda of screwed. Oh I don't know what I was like, I, I, <laughs> for last year's Halloween stream, I, uh, like, I got spooked in Resident Evil 2 on fucking VS1. I'm a big baby when it comes up. Oh. When it comes to, like, most horror games. I got the cool biohazard on PS2. I I, need, I do I wanna pick up uh one and three at some point, so I can have the like, kind of complete collection just to kind of own What was it? My, my, my I bought a Dreamcast like two, three, four years ago at this point. I've barely touched it, but I've uh, Code Veronica on it. I I do wanna open that at some point and kinda of play it. It's like, uh, I'm too lazy to plug in, plug in my Dreamcast, so this is sitting on my Sonic movies at this point. It's also like, I, I've now I've been systems unplugged, uh, I have my, my classic, which is the, uh, NES, SNES, uh, PlayStation. Uh, my Xbox 360, my Wii, my PS3, and now my Dreamcast. Oh. Yeah, th those Platinum versions are, like, a weird one. I do want to get some European ones at some European games at some point. Uh, it's kind of for my collection wise. I, I, I'm mainly going after the Yokai Watch stuff and Inazuma 11s. It, it would be nice to have some PlayStation Jap uh, European games. Bop. I swear, like, you the cases kind of are kind of quotations. I I, I really like the blue jet, uh, the blue blue cases the European has. Oh, what scaly!
Uh, yeah, I mean, like, not too surprising, just because, uh... They've been on the rise, just because everybody's trying to collect American games. It's also... They run better than most retro games uh, in Europe. <laughs> because, what, you guys had 50 hertz for your, uh... A systems from what like uh, what I remember. So it's it's just kind of better the import the uh, North American releases so that you can live at sixty hertz. Playing like it's 100 times match. Yeah, I mean, it's what? I, I think most games on DS. I mean, it's also like DS is region free, same as PC to a point. So it, it is kind of easier to get stuff from the US. Or vice versa. Also, like, mm, uh, I, I feel like most licensed games, like the Antenna one or High School Musical one or whatnot, didn't release in uh, Europe. Uh, I was, I was theorizing at that point. I'm not, not fully sure. Like, it, it's super weird. Uh, when it comes to game releases worldwide, especially licensed ones. At some point, I need to order myself a European 2DS and new 2DS to uh, own for my collection since those are the only models I'm currently missing. It's also like European games I do want to uh, get at some point, mainly that as I was saying, Yokai Watch, uh, Inazuma 11, but like stuff like Tomodachi Life. Uh, the um, Triforce Heroes is another one for its translations and everything. But, uh, I'm really interested in game translation stuff like that. Also, Professor Lightning, because I feel like those are kind of cheaper down there, maybe? I was like, I'd probably still set up for a. Uh, A uh, Japanese copy of anything. Translations during like a 2016 Nintendo era 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 are, are so weird. I mean, like even before that too, it's always gonna have been different localization teams for uh, Europe and North America.
Heck yeah. I, I could have I could have gone for anybody else, but here I am going after that single blue boy. What is that? I I I, 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 I do want to go to Europe at some point. I can go to that shop. Uh, that John Carway keeps posting that fucking PlayStation Classic ad, and just, and just buy it. But that system need, needs a pity home. That that that, that system is so, uh, so neglected. We have a type of Kinder uh, bars here. Uh, what is that? I have to. I have to... It, it's a bit different from like the ones I'm looking at. Uh. I think I was hit stop on uh, this next match. Uh, uh big overlay. Not there. Uh, yeah, we, we got these as like our Kinder chocolate bars. Like are are pretty good. I, I do really like these a whole bunch. But it's like I I have never seen these uh around at all. And I, I would like to the probably try them at some point. These they they seem kinda neat. Oh, uh The, 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 these are peak fiction. The, the, these are so. I'm, I'm just on a chocolate rant. It's like, yeah, my, 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 the stores I go to don't have those type of Kindle bars, but they have the uh, the other ones. But but uh, Smarties, so good. I I, I have them all the time. Well, kind of. But in Canada, we used to have the Smarties cat. Right, it, it, it's super weird. Uh, let's, let's, let the advertisements we had. <clears throat> Blue is back. You could win a MacBook Pro. Eat the Smarties. Mmm, delicious. Blue is back. Win a Mac. Enter at Smarties.ca. Uh, we do as up to, um, like, we do have these, I just, I just never grabbed them. Uh, I don't like Cadbury very much. Uh, well, actually, no, the only Cadbury things I have are the caramel chocolates. These are like the only Cadbury thing I, I I do intake. It's like they're, they're pretty good. Oh, that's so cool! I mean. We, we don't we don't have a whole lot over here, so <laughs> that's pretty cool. Um, th th these are like 
Probably my favorite chocolate, maybe. Uh, I'm, I'm gonna talk about chocolate for the last 10 minutes for this stream. The, the, the chocolate time. Marvelous. What are these? What are these? Oh, these, oh, these are kind of cool. These are like some Wonka type beats. The Coffee Crisp are like a Canadian thing. I think also some of uh some of the United States, but it's it's been like a Canadian thing. It's if you ever see them around, I'd recommend like trying them out. Uh... Oh yeah, arrows. Uh... These are like okay. You usually when you buy those like big boxes of chocolate to give to kids on Halloween. Uh we usually have those leftover these arrows and I, I just take them. I'm like, oh, these are mine. They're, they're so just like they're so nothing, but the chocolate for them are pretty good. I, I don't think I've actually ever tried the mint ones at all. Maybe. It, it's it's going to have been forever. Oh, my fucking milk tweezers. These are some of my favorites. Also. You like that. The big fan of these. I, I I always I never go to the movies. I usually just grab them. Um, what else is there? We don't have like a lot of original chocolate chocolates. I have sort of like coffee crisps. Our our like our main thing has been it's kind of been chips. Um. It was like we 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 love our ketchup chips. Uh, ev everywhere you look, there's there will always be ketchup chips. Everywhere you look, there there will forever be ketchup chips. Uh, one of my one of my favorites are are has always been like hickory sticks, just because they're like peppermint. They're not peppermint. A barbecue flavor type of things. Ah, uh, milky bars. Uh, I don't think I've seen these. I should probably put in music. Ignore, ignore the Spotify. So that's gonna like fly across the screen for a moment. Ooh, oh, shit! I closed. I closed everything. Oh shit! Uh, uh. Ooh, Spotify. Uh, Uh, I popped it up in a different bar. What are these? What, what are these? What are the? Oh, wait. Uh, 
That's the reason I'm looking at them like, yeah, they, these are just Cheetos. <laughs> these are just Cheetos. Like they look like them, look like that to me. I like Takis. Takis. Never had Takis. They scare me. Like they got they got ninja from running Takis at one point. Yeah. What are these? I I also haven't seen these before. These are so neat. I found game work steps open up. I, 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 I'm going through my tabs. British snack. Like they don't, they don't look like they don't taste like Cheetos, but like they kind of look like they would like. Crunch down like Cheetos. <laughs> yeah, also see Cheetos. Yeah, I've never seen these before. I used to have these, like, kind of all the time growing up. Especially, I, I do these for Halloween, I'm like, oh, fuck yeah, time to chat on these. Uh... I uh... Ice cream. D dibs, there we go, dibs. These used to be, like, sold in Canada for, like, a long time. These, like, dip things are, like, uh, they were popular in Canada. And, like, are, like, really good. But, like, they, because it's just, like, little bite-sized things of ice cream on, was, like, layered with chocolate. I'm like, oh, they were so good. Anytime I'd go to, like, my local Mac store, I'd grab these. But, like, one day it's up selling them in Canada. And it's fucked up. I know these are still sold in the uh, in the U.S. <laughs> uh, why, why do I see in videos the movie? You, you can't probably see it. Uh, fucking invaders in right here. Uh, so spe speaking of cartoons, uh. I, I've been watching particularly Spider-Man. I, I, I also have started it. Is uh, I have never seen it growing up. I'm like, I, I'm in the Spider-Man mood. I'll, I'll start to that, and it's also I've been, I've been seeing like clips, kind of all over TikTok recently. It's like, yeah, why, why not? It's 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 neat from my what I've watched. I, I just feel like episodes just kind of come and go without any real thing. And like the first couple episodes have just been like villain on top of villain introducing. And I'm like, you get, yeah, you guys gotta calm things down just a bit. Uh, I'm going to episode about to start episode four. Yeah, it seems neat. It's it, it isn't my Spider-Man that I grew up with. 
Uh, this show is like a fever dream, but like also a good fever dream. Um, I should probably end stream soon as I said I'd do an hour, but here I am talking about fucking Spider Man. I, I love how the show looks. It's, it's such weird CGI. Marvel Histories. Uh, I... No, I, this is my first time hearing, uh, hearing about this. What the fuck is this? I'm too cool for school. Yeah, I guess it, I guess it never came to Canada, maybe. Ah, eh, maybe. Oh no, it did come to Canada. Uh, I saw that thing about Canada on the page here. Yeah, I'm BBC Kids. Yeah, I, I, I was never a BBC Kids type of person. I don't think I actually watched anything from uh, this. The Adventures of Paddington Bear. Uh. Oh, what's this movie? That's a classic. Uh, what is it? All right, I'll show off like one more thing before I end. <laughs> uh, let's see. Uh, mystery theme song. A, a, a classic, a a Canadian classic. This thing looks totally spies, but we look past that. There's also a big gay man, man, uh, as like a main character. I, I, I lied, I lied. I got, I got two more things to show off. This one's also cool. I never, I never probably grew up on this, but uh, I, I, I love the opening very much. I like these guys, they seem very cool. What makes one person sad makes a shrink quite happy. Anyway, the final one, I, I, I swear. Uh... Right. I, I was like this one.
Yeah, it, it's... It, it's a neat scene with people from other countries I've watched. Especially, e each network has our... Like, network has our own thing. You may, need, you may know a Nickelodeon kid, or a Cartoon Network kid, or, or whatnot. You, you, you never you never seen the Donkey Kong TV show? You, you, you never seen the Donkey Kong TV show? This shit's like peak fiction. Uh, I I guess I'm not in the stream for a bit. Uh. <laughs> Oh, there was like kind of two Donkey Kong TV shows at the time. Donkey Kong Planet, which was was mainly a French uh, related thing, uh, and like a and the main show, which was a like uh, the show. I'm a Donkey Kong kid. Me and Brady are Donkey Kongs. James may maybe the Donkey Kong kid. I don't know. Uh, that show is like pretty good, surprisingly. And like, it was kind of really damn popular in Japan enough to get like a a manga adaptation, kind of, and like a multiple play sets. Oh. Yeah, Donkey Kong manga. Uh, but it's on the TV show here. Yeah, mostly. I was working on translating uh, a bit of it. I definitely need to sit around and continue working on it more. But it, it, it's based off the TV show. It, it, it covers a couple of the episodes. And has the crystal coconut. Uh... Towards the end of, like, Volume 1, uh, they introduced the 64 characters, like, uh, or, I mean, like, this mainline Donkey Kong characters, like, Dixie, uh, not Dixie, uh, shit, uh, Chunky Kong, Lanky, uh, I, I do not remember her, her name very much. She exists. Maybe that's Dixie. I don't. I don't, I don't know. Yeah, but like every every like volume one, they kind of start doing their own thing. What was like the source material? Well, also like yeah, Kitty Kong is also here. Let's say Miss Candy. It's like it, it's a weird mix of like. Actual show characters and uh, original game characters too. Uh, was it volume three? Yeah, here we go. Or chapter three. It has Bluster Kong as uh, as he appears. I, I do want to get around to working on this series uh, again. So it, it's such like a neat thing.
I, I, I cleaned up like all the panels for the most part. I just gotta clean out the text, uh, translate all this. Uh, where is the most popular panel people have most likely seen? Uh,. I feel like that's somewhere in volume two. I right, even Captain Scurvy is here. I love Captain Scurvy. Uh. Uh, not not on the fun. There's one panel. Maybe it's no, no. Here it is. Yeah. Uh. Like th this single panel here, people have spread around, and you may have seen it around here or there. And, and most people credit to a Donkey Kong. Uh. Donkey Kong sixty four manga, but no, it's this is from the Donkey Kong TV show manga. Blanky, Blanky's dead. Uh, how is it? I I do have like chapter one translated, quote in quote heavily translated. Uh, I I usually a bit of like Google Translate, a bit of the show itself. It's it's a weird hodgepodge. I definitely need to like redo at some point. I also like need to redo t some of the typesetting as it, it's it isn't the best. I, I I've definitely done a lot better and definitely done a lot worse. It's especially like this stuff, I I needed to properly redo. Um, uh, TV show, uh, Japanese sets. Yeah, it, it got like a whole play set and like other stuff. Which I, I do want to get this, uh, Cranky's Hut at some point. It's like it, I believe I believe it's expensive, give or take. I I'd have to look around my normal like sites. Uh, yeah, they also got, like the standard ones, with characters in minecarts. Um, uh, they they also had the card game. It was super like nutty. Uh, release and like. I do want to pick them up at some point. Uh... Where is it? Uh... Here we go. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know what's happening to me. I'm getting all the blame for things I didn't do. Can't anybody tell me just what? 
Thank you, Donkey, for that one. I, oh, I, I just love the music for this show. Here's my favorite. I'll, I'll play this. So bless me. When do I start? Auditions are tomorrow at noon. I'll bring the script. You bring the talent. Did he say noon? Actually, the, 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 the song also this also sounds like really good. I I love. <laughs> The next one, like, also one of my favorites. Let's make it easy. It's simple. If you're the bad guy in the movie, you think like a bad guy, you talk like a bad guy, you become a bad guy. Think about the meanest guy that you know. Is he cruel? Is he bad? Does he talk real slow? It's the villain that I want to play. I don't know if I can be that way If I gotta be bad, I gotta find a way Talk bad, look bad, be bad Walk bad, think bad, be bad The feeling in your mind has to be unkind If you wanna be good, you gotta be bad Lies and fibs, cheats and steals My treacherous villainy makes me squeal I never tip <laughs> But in line, I never clean the dishes and it suits me fine. I'm so pleased and such a sleaze. This bad guy thing's a breeze. Gonna still gonna be untrue. My black heart is through and through. If I wanna be bad, I gotta walk in his shoes. Talk bad, look bad, be bad. Walk bad, think bad. Be bad. Oh, I like that. I got Um. Oh, I, 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 I got, I gotta show this one. Off. I, gotta, I gotta show this one off. Take my 
Say the line. I shower you with coconut cream pies. Thank you, Donkey Kong. Shared, shared Bannon for a while. Okay. <laughs> oh, hi. <laughs> yes, your majesty. <laughs> uh, I Uh, I, I don't know why I chose you. It's yeah, I know. <laughs> I know. I'm like, huh. I, I I did see the message. Blame Drew for the shirt ban info. Maybe? I don't think so. One of my favorites. I got a funny tweet idea. I'll have to, have to, I'll have to post that later. Uh, I'll do, I'll do one more. Uh, before I, before I add. Uh. Let me go home. No can do. What are we going to do? Go what for snow go cones? No. I can't believe what I see. Everything's upside down and it makes no sense to me. In my current state, I can't change the fate. If you send me back, I swear I'll set things straight. You gotta send me back. No you know do. I can do. Who like exist? Eddie, let me go back to my home. Without me, everything's all wrong. Eddie, let me go back to my home. Let me put things back where they belong. Eddie, let me go back to my home. Without me, everything's all wrong. Eddie, let me go back to my home. Please, I'm down on my knees. There's a world that needs saving, baby, Bobby, Eddie, Eddie, just let me be. Oh, man, won't you hear my plea? Come on, come on, Eddie, you got to help me. You got to save me back. 
Your nice shore. Oh wait, Jose. Thanks, Eddie. You're in luck, Congo Bongo. I'm back. Wow. Uh, Lundy, Congo Bongo. Bongo. <laughs> but I, I, fucking, I fucking love, uh, I fucking love Eddie. Oh, the uh, end time. That. I, I said that like 30 minutes ago, give or take. <laughs> <laughs> 